Well, that's all the snow. So let's get you into that heavy snow with our meteorologist, Mike Seidel. Snow already falling. It's been falling, and you can expect to see more uh, before this is over, Mike. Yes, sir, Nick. Uh, up here in the upstate, temperatures are cold all the way up through the column, so we're not dealing with freezing rain or sleet. Now, we may have some sleet later on today and tonight. We've got about an inch on the ground. Uh, this area doesn't get a whole lot of snow, typically about five inches a season. Some years they won't get any. This year, though, they had an, almost two inches yesterday and almost an inch now, a little over an inch today. So they're way ahead of the game for February, and we may end up as a top five or top ten February daily snowfall. Here on Haywood Road, they have salted and they've sanded, so the the road has kind of slushed up. We do have the daytime uh, sunlight not getting through the clouds, but the radiation gets through and the sun angle is getting higher. So that's helping up the roadways. And the bottom line is, much like in Atlanta, the roads are, are barren today. There's very few cars out. There was no rush hour, and that's great. Everybody's just sitting tight. And fortunately, we have snow and not ice. And when you got snow, you have to plow and shovel it. But who wants to plow and shovel, right? Charlie Payne from <laughs> yes. Super Droid Robots. We had you on earlier. Got a lot of uh, feedback on Twitter and Facebook. They want to see the robot do its thing here. Yeah, yeah normally you'd be doing this indoors uh, so you can stay warm. But That's right. You can do this from the front window yeah, and do your whole driveway. Look out right? the window and uh, Let's go, do it. go to town. Well, look at this. Now, is this a, don't take me out. <laughs> take, whoa, take out an OCM. Now, granted, we only have about an inch of snow, but you can see uh, just how easy this is. We'll spin it on around. Let me ask you, Charlie, how long can it run on one battery charge? Uh, last snow's storm we had, I did my whole lot, which is a business, and we did it on two charges. I get about two hours out of it, uh, continuously pushing snow. And it does okay with heavy, wet snow, because this is a dry powder. Yeah, snow. the last snow we had was pretty wet. It was about three, four inches, and we had no problem with it at all. So. And you told me this is kind of a one of a kind because you build a lot of robots. Yeah, but this most of our stuff is custom. This is a, another custom robot. If we get a lot of interest, we'll make it a standard product. About $8,500. Yes, huh? $8,500. So, yeah. so there you go, Nick. Sit in your house in front of the fire and use the Super Droid robot to uh, take care of the snow. That's pretty cool. Here, here it really is. There's a lot of folks right oh, now going, look at hmm. that. Doing 360s. <laughs> Doing 360s and back it up. Amazing. That's great. I love this. Back to you guys there in Atlanta. Yeah, we'll, Mike, we'll a lot keep of folks going. 